Hi everyone, Antoinette here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about how introverts can better handle small talk. Now notice I didn't say how introverts can grow to love small talk because in general introverts actually hate small talk. So I'm going to talk about some of the reasons why small talk is important, the purpose of it, and how you as an introvert can be better at it. Believe me, as an introvert, I hate small talk, but I have come to understand that it's one of those necessities in life that is not going away. Because if we don't have small talk, we have two alternatives. We can either jump into a deeper conversation uh, with someone when they may not be warmed up yet to be able to feel comfortable getting into a deeper conversation, or we can choose to just ignore the person completely and not have any engagement with them. And what happens when we do that is we can get the reputation for somebody who is standoffish, rude, doesn't want to communicate or engage with others. First of all, think of small talk like a social lubricant. It helps warm up a situation when you're in the proximity of someone or, or maybe it's somebody that you're working with or, or a neighbor that you're coming in contact with. Small talk is that lubricant to make you both feel more at ease with each other rather than this feeling like there's an awkward silence. The times that you want to be ready for small talk are a lot of times when you're in close proximity to another person. Say, for instance, you are in an elevator or you're standing with somebody in a line for an extended period of time. Do you have to make conversation with them? No, you don't have to make conversation with them. But sometimes somebody in those situations will try to initiate. They may make some kind of comp conversation or comment to you. And in that situation, who is the person that you want to be? If somebody initiates with you, if somebody initiates some type of greeting or some type of comment or question, any kind of small talk thing, even if there's somebody that you're not going to see again, and reciprocate with a pleasant expression, with eye contact, with a pleasant answer to their question or comment. It's all about who do you want to be? How do you want to establish your reputation as a person? Even if it's somebody that you're never going to see again, who do you want to come across as a person? So as an introvert, I have found that I need to prepare even for small talk. Extroverts, I don't think ever have to prepare for small talk. They can just talk about anything. However, as an introvert, I need to prepare ahead of time and think about what are some questions that I could ask someone. Okay, I'm getting ready to go to this sporting event and I'm gonna probably need to make small talk with some people. What are some questions that I can ask? And then I also want to think about what are some things that are going on in my life so that if I do run into somebody and they say, hey, what's been going on? What's new with you? I don't have to just say nothing or can't think of anything new. I can actually offer up a little bit of information about what is going on in my life. But for me as an introvert, I actually, actually have to think about those things ahead of time because it's so difficult to think on my feet. If you're the type of person who gets stuck with small talk and how do you get past it, I have a video above and in the description below about two questions you can ask to get past small talk. As an introvert, you probably have been told that you're a really good listener. And that can be a great conversation advantage that you have over extroverts or over people who are not good listeners. So you can ask those small talk questions, really listen to what people's answers are, and really get curious and ask them some other questions or, or give up some comments of your own regarding whatever they say. What can happen in those situations is you might just get to a deeper level of conversation that you probably will find more rewarding. Now, do you know of an introvert who needs help with small talk? If so, I hope you'll share this video with them. 